Ah, hello, my friend. Hey, what are you looking so cool, calm, and collected for? I guess because I'm not the one who's about to die based on some inappropriate decision I made a long time ago. Ah, thanks for the moral support. I appreciate it. What the fuck ever happened to Barry in the past, huh? Any fool should be able to turn over a new leaf, right? Well, first, your new leaves aren't so very different from your previous leaves. Seems like they fell from a pretty similar tree. And second, this is the age of the internet, my ludite friend. Nothing is forgotten. There are no new leaves. Everything you do and don't do is recorded forever and used to beat you. This is the age of judgment day every day. And in the revelation of that, I'd say that you got off pretty lightly, what with all the, uh, the murders and the, and, and the thefts and... All right. This straight-talking new, uh, tell-it-like-it-is-reality guy act. Uh-huh. That ain't working so well for me. In that case, um, don't worry about it. Everything is fine. You're a good man and a great father, really. It's more like it. Hey, what's up, y'all? Hey. So what y'all talking about? The Internet age. <laughs> The internet age? Oh, yeah. Man, ain't we got a hotly defended federal building to fucking rob? Yes, we do. Let's get after it. I'm gonna miss this place. If we're gonna do this thing and maybe take that score, well, I... I guess this has all gotta be gone. All right, with the sad goodbyes. Agent Stevie cleared the noose building in Palomino Highlands as a base for this op. All right, now, let's roll on this thing. Why are you so chipper? Shit, why are you so miserable? Must be an age thing. Great. Now, there's something to look forward to. What's the plan again, man? And please, let it involve someone shooting you for being so goddamn miserable. Oh, what is this? Pick on me day? Look, I know I'm a miserable old prick, but give me a break. You and Lester. Shit! So the plan was feeling sorry for your ass, right? I miss Lester saying that shit, for sure. Let's feel sorry for Michael. Rich. White Michael. Poor Michael, who robbed banks for ten years, then got his slate wiped clean. Yeah, yeah. Poor Michaels, whose homies get into shit with the FIB out of the kindness of their own hearts. Put their necks on the line. Man, where's my get-out-of-jail-free car, motherfucker? I'm sorry, okay? You know what, Mike? You a real easy dude to identify with, man. Poor me. Pour me. Man, pour me a drink, nigga. Okay. Okay. I can see. Maybe I've been a little caught up in myself lately. A little? Man, just give me the plan, okay? All right. Here's the shot. We're taking a chopper up to altitude, jumping out, and climbing in through the Bureau skylight. We hit the computer system. That might take a while, so we gotta hold off any resistance. Once we're in the system, we download the files. Chopper picks us up. Hey, that was real simple, wasn't it? I'm informed now, dawg. So you want to wallow in some more of your self-pity? Get another free therapy session? Actually, now that you mention it... Hey, fuck you! Honest and angry. This is some of the best mental health work I've done in years. Man, it's gonna cost you, homie. Trust me, you gonna pay for that shit. All right, we're coming up. Chopper pilot, gunman, driver, and hacker should be ready. I'll radio in. Guys, you there? Always on time, bro. These places with the creeps, homes. Same with this fat pilot. Okay, I need my engineer stationed outside the building calling in updates. On it, bro. I'll get over there. Hey, here we go, man. This is on. All right, you're Haynes' pilot, right? We gotta wait until it's late enough, then we move in the chopper. You can take us up. I'll get on the stick when you jump.
might be a better pilot, but I'm less inclined to kill you in your sleep. Shit, that ain't what he says. Okay, I'm less inclined to stab you in the face and then do funny things to your corpse. That sounds about right. Hey, everyone, quick pep talk. My friend Franklin here called me out for being an ungrateful prick on the way over here. I have to admit, I've been remiss. Everyone's being paid on this run, except me. But it ain't great money for the crazy target you're drawing on your back, and there's a good chance this thing won't work at all. I took the job. I knew it was gonna be like that. So, in short, thank you for your efforts. It means a lot to me. I picked you guys out especially for this shit show. So take something from that, if you will. There'll be more scores down the road, maybe a big one, and sunnier days ahead. But this is where we are right now. So let's try to survive it and achieve our objectives. We stick together, we might not die. That's what's getting me through this. All right. When you say jump, I'll jump. Hey, come on. Grab the stick. You got it. You ready? Uh, are you? Are you fucking kidding me? I'm lucky I can even breathe at this altitude, let alone calculate the odds of fuck driving the jump, landing, fuck fucking fuck firefighters, whatever else the blowback there might be. Okay. Come on, Franklin. Let's go, buddy. Got it. Great. Oh, better than an elevator. Ah, oh, fuck. We're in. Good for you, bro. I'm out here. Hey, here you go, dog. That's a nice weapon. Good people bring the right tools for an occasion. Let's get ready for the security. I think maybe the alarm's going. Yeah, no shit. An explosion will tend to do that. I'm looking at the terminal. They better be. Maybe they're in, like, my computer. So, if I were you, I'd, like, find my hack programs. At least one of us is a computer expert. So, I'm thinking you, like, find that number at the top and all those numbers in the middle? There's a lot of fucking numbers, bro. To be honest, I must have skipped this class in school. This is, like, way, way above my skill level. I might have to go back to school again, so I can drop out again. Find that number, dude. That's all I can say. All right, I'm connected. No thanks to you. No need to be aggressive, bro. I'm stretching myself. I think you're looking for a password here. So, like, yeah, you're trying to stop those red letters in, in the middle. 
There might be a bit of luggage or something. Okay, I'm in. You got anything other than a guess for this part? You never mention anything about networks, bro. Just saying. Okay, people, we're rewriting history. Bros, I think they're coming. Hear that? We gotta hold them off while this thing completes its process. Hey, we knew this was coming. Let's do this. I'm gonna stay here and make sure this download happens. It's underway! We'll need that chopper ASAP! Get her over the building! Airless initiated. Flying by the building. Check the entry points! Yo, lion cowboys! Hey, come on, pop these motherfuckers! Hey, chopper's here! The network ain't down yet! I'll hold here. Wait on your signal for pickup. What you hiding, asshole? We know you ain't kosher! Want some files? MIB choppers, pick me up. Bringing it down. Incoming! I'm hit! I'm hit! Get it! Get it! Ground! No! Hey! 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 Choppers, go on, dudes. Fuck! Be out! Don't worry, we got a backup plan. Use the harnesses. Repel from a few floors down. Ah, oh, shit, they smoking us out. Smoke bomb, be cool. Serious bad luck, bros. What? Dude, that chopper crash ripped the ass out of the building. A couple of floors, man. Devastation. Great. Ah, thanks. Yo, leave us be, man. You think there's enough of them? Leave us to it, punk! It's done, man! Go grab your cell! About time! Got it. Alright, people. Let's get the hell out of here. Coming through! Get on the floor! Hey, let's move! I got this door! Good body, let's move! Hold on, I hear something in the stairwell. Opening, shall we go? Let's keep it moving, dog! Hey, we got a problem up here! Sprinkler system! Can't see anything! Man, can a hacker shut it off? Lucas! Sprinkler system. You got any ideas? Dude, I would not know where to start. Maybe like take a screwdriver to him? Of course. Why did I ask? Moving! Moving! Hey, you gotta see this. Fuck! Well, he didn't make it. You sure, man? Cause he might be a... No, he didn't make it. Are oh, you funny, huh, motherfucker? Man, well, let's get the fuck out of here. No, we're too high. The wind will tie us in a knot. We gotta keep moving. Come on, let's go. Hey. Fuck! Oh! Come on, you asshole! Come on, come on! Corrupt ass bitch! Following you! Let's go! Oh, I'm sorry, my love! <laughs> Through here! You're oh. dead! Oh. Out of the way! Oh. Always moving! You gonna step to me? You in our way! Run or get clapped! Let's get out of here! FIB! Get out of the way! Let's go! Let's go! I'll kill you! You gotta go, Fed! 
Hey, let's move! We got what we came for! <laughs> let's do this! Moving! Moving! Stairs, man! Come on! Following you! Damn, come on! We on! Got a guy down! You gonna step to me? Man, we going! Keep going! We can get out over here, dog. We low enough? Yeah, this'll do. Set up the rigs. All right, come on. What's going on on the outside? Same old shit, bro. Making bacon. All right, even with your deal. Um, maybe they call the military or something? Well, then we better get gone before they show up. Let's get the fuck out of here, then. Okay, let's blow this joint. Over to the right, dog. Man, it's about every cop in L.S. County on the way. It don't look like they're for us. Not yet, at least. Awkward, bros. A bureau chopper seen you on the side of the building. Ah, crap! They got a bird! Go! Go! Hey, set up the rope there, and we'll drop to the street. That's it. Gotta go. No shit. Let's get cracking, man. Unless you're feeling at home in this bed building. Hey, you want to sign with Trevor? Feel free. Man, man, I was just fucking with you, dog. Let's do this shit. Driving me to the south front, right? right. See the drive. Kareem, come in. Hey, you're not at the pickup spot. Yeah, no shit, man. Cops have the whole block locked down. It's gonna be another few minutes. Cut rate, asshole. If it's any longer than that, we're gonna have words. Look out, news team. We gotta hold him up till the driver makes it. Let me guess, this driver came cheap, huh? Yeah, he was only supposed to be a backup. If the chopper hadn't the crash, we wouldn't have needed him. I'm your ride. Get in here. Oh, God. Oh. I brought the van. You're driving it.
that chopper hadn't crashed, I wouldn't even need to be here. Okay, we lost him, Frank. We're meeting Lester at your place for a debrief. Hey, Corrine, if you're ever late for a pickup again, I'm gonna leave your ass for the cops, okay? I hope you get that. Boom, now we're clear, I can probably say I never expected to make it out of there. Yeah, sure, man. We had it covered. Oh, really? It was covered, was it? Uh, yeah. Lester had the plan. It was all set up. Yeah, we had a plan. Hold off the nastiest team of crooked FIB agents in the country while the last of the baby boomers pretends he's a hacker? Come on. It was hopeful. And then when the chopper crashed? Oh, man. I thought there was no fucking way. Why do you think Lester burned down the business? Hell, why do you think I'm doing it for nothing? And these clowns are getting paid? I got a lifestyle to maintain. Cars, holidays, my watch collection, hormones. So what if my cell phone tells the time? Having a cell phone ain't the same as wearing 12 grand on your wrist. You can't begrudge me my passions. It wasn't my intention to begrudge you anything, pal. That said, I see you spending this money in a way that the authorities will notice. You're gonna wake up one morning with a gun in your mouth. Uh, um, okay. Of course. Hey, man, tell him you messing with him, Mike. Hey, I was semi-sorta serious, but... Joking once you reacted like that, all right? Chill out. Look, man, he was just messing with y'all. It's his great sense of humor. The FIB people who put us up to this, they probably gonna pop him anyway to clean up loose ends. And if they don't, he got a homeboy named Trevor that probably will. That's a good point. I ain't gonna have the time to spend it, so enjoy. Ah, uh, yeah, cool. We can joke about how screwed up your damn life is. <laughs> yeah, well, what else are we gonna do? Besides, Trevor ain't a problem, and Dave will look after me, I think. I just wanted some sympathy, all right? I didn't mean anything by it. Nothing at all. Hey, at least I'm getting paid for this job. I don't know what they got on you dudes, but that's some heavy shit to get into for free. Well, people, we did it. A raid on the Bureau. It wasn't the biggest job or the smartest, but it was probably the ballsiest. Yeah, he is to that. Yeah, boy. I'm still shaking. I'm still so fucking tense. Man, that could be the job. Or it could be you thinking about all the dudes who want to clap your ass. Yeah, probably a bit of both. <laughs> nah, no one's gonna clap me. I just need to get my shit together. Nah, man, what you need is a damn drink. Oh, yeah. Kareem, Frank's place is up here. You think you can dispose of the vehicle and drop him somewhere? I think I can manage that.
Hey, come on in, man, but... Damn, Franklin. Oh, Jesus. Yeah. Any longer, I was gonna torch this place, too. <laughs> hey, hey, you did it! We did it! Yeah! yeah. Fuck it, <laughs> hey. Hey, where's my liquor at, dog? Oh, I got it. It's right here. Let's go, let's go. Come on. Here it is. Come here it is. Shit. There you go. Man, you may be a conflicting, hypocritical, self-loafing old bastard, dog, but there's no one else I'd rather rob a federal building with. <laughs> Amen to that. Thank you, boys. Cheers. Cheers. <laughs> so, you want another drink? I think I better stay at least a little bit sober. I gotta deal with the baby at Big Wad yet. Put things to bed. Now you want me to roll with you, dog? No, uh, I'd probably better do this alone. I mean, we did everything. We're all in this together, right? So as long as we all are not together, there's nothing they can really do to us. All right, I see you, dog. Get care. Then it's Trevor, and I'm out. Oh, well, we're gonna need Trevor. We should give him a call now. No, no, fuck that. Damn. After I take care of this shit. All right, all right. Well, take care of yourself. Drinking! That's stuff. And that's your needs a drink! We hit the bureau for you, Dave. I'm done. Yes, I saw that. Meet me at the court center and I'll debrief you. I'm, I'm out, hey, Davey. From, from now on, I'm done. I, I appreciate that. I'm, I'm trying my best for you, but, but you and Trevor attacking Merriweather? Repeatedly? It, it doesn't help. That, that's Trevor's thing. Whoever's thing it is, it's unauthorized and it's dumb. They've been sniffing around my office. We really need to talk. Really? All right, all right, all right. I'll come to the court center. Fuck. Oh. No. Sugar plum. Daddy, I'm in trouble. What is it? Money? Drugs? Your mother. There's this guy. He's been following me around. I think he's about to do something. Where are you? Vinewood Plaza. Okay, wait there. He's been following me in my car, so let's just drive around and you can talk to him when he shows. Oh, yeah. We'll talk. Let's go find him. We should try over at Hawaii and see over him. We're looking for a guy in a purple convertible. I don't remember what make. Okay, I'll keep an eye out. Thanks, Daddy. Hey, what are dads for, huh? I mean, other than giving you money, putting a roof over your head, speaking to guys who ridicule you on TV. Passing out drunk in front of old movies, screaming at boys I'm dating, freaking out when a cop car drives past. Is he here? Hello? No, he's not around. We should try that motel opposite the big construction site. 
where'd you meet this guy? Uh, at a signing? What are you signing? A pot petition? Yo, you better not be taking out credit like your brother. Not credit. You see him? Hey, man. I don't think so. Maybe we should look over at Cluck and Bell. Rockford Plaza. I, I was signing autographs at the expo. People want to meet you after that video on fame or shame? Yeah, yeah, the videos. Ah, uh, well, now you just got to find a way to make money out of it. <laughs> <laughs> We found this brick? Not yet. Okay. Oh, uh, how about going around the corner and back up the hill past Crockahoop? My baby girl's a celebrity with her very own stalker. You finally made it, Dad. You raise your kids in Rockford Hills. What was I thinking? You know, it's amazing you've turned out this good. Okay, you around here? Ah, purple car, that's him! Fuck, he's on you! Let's go! What do you mean you can't feel your leg? D-A-D-W-T-F! Oh. Yeah, Dad! He's out of the car! I get it, I'm going! I'll never come back. I'm an addict. I need help. I'm the victim. He's running! Don't kill me for loving her! That ain't love. It's the internet. You're a cyber creep. You're right. You're right. I'm getting help. Don't kill me! I'm gonna be sick. Sir! You showed him, Pop! He's freaking out! Run, you little bastard! All the way out of town! I'll leave the state! I promise! I'm going to Thailand! I mean rehab! Oh, no. <laughs> Look at him go! He's kind of cute in a guru beach bum kind of way. We're letting him go, right? He got the message. Yeah, I think he got the message. Let's just say it don't look like he's gonna turn up at your next fan club, AGM. The fan club's gone national. That's amazing PR, Pop. I might... Hey, stop it. Be careful next time. Would you mind if I leaked this? Leaked what? I thought we had you potty trained two decades ago. Ew, I meant bleed it or something. No bleeder, no life invader, no whatever else you got. Being this public with your life is what got you into this situation. But it'll really boost my profile. You got creep stalking you. I'd say your profile is plenty boosted already. No creepy stalkers in this joint, honey. Just creepy brothers, killers, drug dealers. Thanks, Daddy. Bye. I'm glad I could use my paternal rage productively for once.
doing period dramas, not this reality show shit. I am not kidding. Good to see you, Slick. Devon, the hell are you doing here? It's over, Michael. You're done good, kid. You kept this bullshit up long enough to help me trigger a fantastic insurance payout when the plug is pulled. I love you. You're, you're like my spirit brother now. Where's Solomon? He's out getting the negatives of film, whatever the fuck it is. The last dinosaur in town is about to get fossilized. What are you talking about? Look, the movie's nearly done, so if the plug's pulled now, the investors, meaning us, get a massive insurance payout. Meanwhile, I can use that to get the other major shareholder, the old bastard's idiot son, to agree to tear this relic down and let me redevelop the area for condos. <laughs> in this economy, the city's gonna let me build tax-free. I might even get some rebates. It is a brilliant thing, and it is all thanks to you and Molly's eye for the details of the insurance policy. Michael! They're fucking us! The suits! And they don't even wear suits! Wolves in birds' clothing! Try not to take it too badly, Mr. Richards. Were you ever a human being? You know, people used to like films, and now they like what? Videoing themselves, beating off on their ivory phone. Don't blame me. I'm a very spiritual person. I feel badly about this. But evolution is evolution. Gentlemen, Molly. Namaste. Can I, can I take a film now, Mr. Richards? My plane leaves in 25 minutes. Can't we do something? At least let me finish the picture. Then close the place down. I'm afraid our timetable doesn't allow for that. Goodbye, Mr. Richards. Where the hell is she going with that movie? She is taking the only copy offshore, somewhere nice and discreet. Analog. God, it's certainly got its complications. Michael, can you do something? No, he can't do anything, pal. It's an inevitability. My wife got screwed by a yogi. And now I'm getting screwed by a yogi? Fuck that! I'm a producer! Nobody fucks with my film! Get to the airport. Talk, talk. That's it. Slow it down, Slick. You're not thinking. Hey, I'm a producer. I'm producing the goods. Don't do this, Slick. Think. She's got a police escort. She's on the way to my personal hangar. Security at the airport work for me. Yeah. I just want to get the film back before she does anything rash with it. Molly's highly strung. She's not going to stop and talk it out with a deranged killer chasing after her. That ain't who I am today. Look, I don't want to hurt anyone. I just want to get my movie. Slow down and use your brain. Fun time is over.
with you! Lady, on the fucking floor! I know you prefer dictation. Really? We're doing this now? I just watched Devin West's legal counsel get juiced with a jet engine. Oh, that Molly woman? Oh, Lord, that's horrible. You have no idea. She panicked, went crazy, and ran into it. But I saved the print, so we still got our movie. You believe that analog thing? It's all digital. We have backups everywhere. I mean, we're shooting on green screen. Well, you could have told me. I'm sorry. Look, I thought you knew. The edit's nearly done, and we've got to get it out before they can screw us again. I've greenlit a premiere. That will stop them from burying us. A premiere? For Meltdown? Okay. Can you invite my family? They can finally have something to be proud of me for. Of course. It's already on its way by courier. All right. Shit. I'll get ready. It was... An American divorce, by the way. The movie quote. Obviously.
You got lucky, buddy. Ah, see? Davey, that's why we're such great friends, huh? Because we're old school. We like old-fashioned things. Newspapers. Celluloid. Good guys. Bad guys. We're friends? Well, I don't know. You tell me. We did what you said, right? Got those people off your back? Now you're gonna do like you said and cut me loose, right? Things are not gonna work out quite that way. There's a bit of a problem. That's right, Davy boy, you could say that. Steve, I told you I would handle oh, this. Oh, because you've handled everything so fucking well so far, haven't you? All right, I admit things have been a little unorthodox, I'm but... fucking orthodox! You've ruined my career! Agent Sanchez, arrest these men, both oh, of them. Oh, Steve, Oh, whoa! On, please! You fucking kidding me? Arrest me for what? For multiple counts of every fucking crime under the fucking sun. Oh, well, then let me rephrase. Why? Why? Because. Because you don't want me to testify in court about our various business dealings, right? Agent Sanchez, apprehend the suspect! Agent Sanchez, you'll do no such thing. Now, Steve, we agreed to speak to Michael, to try and explain things to him. Not this. This causes problems for us all. Okay, okay. Then put your gun down and we'll talk. After you, buddy. Come on, where's the trust? You can do better than that. They know or think they know that I'm the one that was behind the incident. Uh-huh. And now you want me to clean up your mess again, right? Before I end up at the bottom of the ocean. Fucking good luck with that. Put the weapons down, boys. Fun time is over. We've got you. Anti-American activity. Put your weapons down, all of you. Who the fuck are you with? With me. You fucking rat. I knew you didn't have the balls for this. For the record, I'm a patriot. I love my country. Put the weapons down. Fuck you. We all know you agency boys are ball deep in a plot to drive up your funding by any means necessary. Boys, the gun down, gentlemen. Who the fuck are they? The fucking Merriweather. What are they doing here? Steve, put your gun down. No, oh, same goddamn leg. Go! Fuck! Bullshit. Mike, this your frequency. That's all for you. I ain't going anywhere, Davy, until some more of these guys kill each other. I ain't going anywhere, Davy, until some more of these guys kill each other. What happened to Haynes? He get caught in the crossfire? Don't worry about Haynes. Haynes went the other way. He's probably out. We gotta think of ourselves. Time to meet your maker! Thanks. I'm moving. I'll meet you in the courtyard by that fountain.
for all the shit you've been in? Come at me! They're done! I gotta get out before someone clocks my chopper. Hey! Thanks, T! This is our shot! I'm making a run for the parking lot! Get clear and we'll talk! Come on, it's over here! This many bodies, there'll be cars in the lot. Put as much dirt between you and this place as you can. And do not contact me until you're absolutely sure you're clear. This one's mine. Good luck. Be careful, Davey. Mike, before you disappear, we need to have a conversation. So conversate. Not here. Meet me behind the pawn shop in Morningwood. Shit! Chopper!
Another chopper! Doing smoking, huh? Come on, man. No, no, no. That's bad for you, don't you know, huh? Yeah, well, maybe it's got a little something to do with being caught in the middle of a three-way firefight between two government agencies and a private militia. You know, it gets me a little stressed out. Okay, but we still need you alive, Mikey boy. I mean, you know, at least for now. Unless, of course, you have another surprise for me, huh? Maybe something to do with another inappropriate friendship? Yeah, that wasn't exactly Dave's fault. No, no, no. He's just the friendly face of a corrupt government agency looking to further his career by dealing with an equally corrupt and full to the fucking brim with bullshit low rent hood. Listen, Trevor. Listen, I've been meaning. Uh, you know, I've been meaning. I've been meaning to tell you. You know, I've been. What, homie? What have you been meaning to tell me, huh? That you stabbed me in the back, or that you were and always will be a worthless wretch who deserves to be put under. Yeah, well, no, what the fuck, fuck did you come day? back for? Oh, you know why. Ah, oh, no, no, no. One last score. Mm-hmm. And if it goes good, <laughs> guess what? I don't have to put a little bullet in your head, but if it goes bad, well, that's okay, too. Because then you and I get to go to hell, and I get to spend the rest of eternity with you, tormenting you. Well, I guess it's on, then. Yeah, I guess it is. Call Lester. Let's go. On speakerphone. Hey, it's me. I know. How'd it go? Just fabulous. Ran into an old friend. Matter of fact, he saved my ass. Oh, we're all friends now. Suppose a group hug's out of the question? <laughs> he wants to, uh, still go on the final victory tour. All right, when it looks like it's a go, I'll contact you. And remember this, gentlemen. If we pull this off, we will be making history. Sorted, nasty, depraved history. But history, nonetheless. All right. There. You happy? Fucking thrilled. Don't forget, amigo. Keep my eye on you. Yeah. Michael, 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 what would you do without me? <laughs> 